I don't know why everybody making a big deal out of K.A.W. kick-ass wrestling when for 18 years I've been kicking somebody's ass in wrestling like I'm going to do tonight. Now, I came all the way from my townhouse in Nashville to Memphis, Tennessee for one person, and that's the Golden Boy. Terry Golden, you've been lollygagging, jawjacking, messing around, playing Tilly Winks with Jamie Dundee. Won't you come and break yourself off some of this, boy? But you see, the thing about it is, he must have heard that the Brickster was on his way down here tonight because I've been looking high and low. Terry Golden ain't nowhere around. So they're giving me Tommy Rogers. Well, that's all fine and dandy. Tommy Rogers better slap slob from the promoter's mouth for what he gonna be in store for tonight. Cause I'm gonna be on him like white on rice and everything that ain't nice. Like a collar on a freaking dog. Like ham on a fat Tennessee hog. I'm ready to kick somebody's ass. And Tommy Rogers, if it's you, bring your ass on out here and let's get it on so I can break your something out proper. Brown on top of Tommy Rogers. This match underway. You heard, oh, hi. Backdrop, you heard Brickhouse Brown saying that he wanted Terry Golden tonight. He's mad because Terry Golden last week came out victorious in a battle with J.C. Ice, Jamie Dundee from the old school, and Brickhouse, being a member of the old school, wanted him. But tonight he's facing one half of the Fantastics, Tommy Rogers and Brickhouse. Looking fantastic himself tonight in this matchup. Rick House jumps off the apron. Down on to Tommy Rogers. A couple of left jabs. Finishes off with a right. Since Tommy Rogers down to the floor here in Mardi Gras. Let me take this opportunity here, if I can, to remind you KWA on tour Saturday, April 17th. KW will be busting into Trenton, Tennessee. That is Trenton, Tennessee. Bell time, 8 o'clock. Doors open at 6.30. It's going to be at the National Guard Armory. Oh, stop sign to the head. That's the kind of action you're going to see in Trenton, Tennessee on April 17th. Tickets available now at Fred's and Tennessee Bonding in Trenton, Tennessee. You'll want to get your tickets early. This is the first time KW has been to Trenton, and it's going to sell out. Now, Tommy Rogers in control of Brickhouse Brown from the old school. Sends him back into the ring. Tommy Rogers from ECW just took a low blow shot to the throat. On last week's program, Tommy Rogers and Tracy Smothers teamed up for a very successful win here on KW. Tommy Rogers is a tag team specialist. He's known more for his tag team work than his single competition. He's slinging the rope. Brickhouse with that board to the throat. Sends Rogers down. Brickhouse, although he has been in tag teams over the years, is known primarily as a single wrestler and may have the advantage and he can dance. Only a count of two as Tommy Rogers kicks out of it. Brickhouse setting up Rogers, takes a blow to the midsection. Rogers falls in with the second. Referee Bill Russ checking over the action. Senior referee Alki brought in Bill Russ. You know when KW first got started, it was a big party. Everybody was having a good time. Everybody was a little cavalier in their attitude. But now with people like Sid, with people like Bull Payne, SUKW heavyweight champion, with Man Man Pondo here, with the one-man gang coming into KW, 
people are starting to take things a little more seriously. And senior referee Alki brought in one of the most respected referees in the Mid-South, Bill Rush, to try to keep order in KW rings. You're going to see a lot of changes around here. But now Rogers, superplex off the top rope. Brickhouse Brown, lay down the center. Tommy Rogers had a little bit too much taken out of him. He can't follow it up quickly enough. Crawls over finally for the pin. Count of two, and he almost had it. He almost got Brickhouse on that one. And now Rogers catapulted out of the ring, down to the floor. Brickhouse following him out. Brickhouse on the apron, cross body block. Body block down onto Rogers. Several shots to the jaw with his fist, and now Rogers rolls him over and said, you want some of that buddy? Here it is. Vicious kick to the jaw. Rick out. Looking out to the crowd, possibly for some weapons. Body slam. Out of Brickhouse, the fans holding out their weapons here at Mardi Gras, where we tape every Wednesday night. Bell time is at 8 o'clock. Doors open at 7. Tickets available at the door. Brickhouse Brown with a big sheet of metal. Slams it across. Tommy Rogers back. A vicious shot to the midsection. Two fingers to the eyes. Tommy Rogers throwing the rule book out the window. Takes Brickhouse head first into the ring post. Referee Billy Rush in the ring, waiting for the wrestlers to get back in. At this point, KW, there is no count out. There is no DQ. But things may be getting too out of hand. Elbow off the top rope. Down for the pin cover. Count a two. Count a th no. Only got a two. And now Tommy Rogers laces in. With that chin lock, that was broken up very quickly by Brickhouse Brown with a rake across the eyes. Sets up for a swinging neck breaker. Both men have spent a lot of energy in this matchup. Brickhouse going back for the board. Drives it down to the throat. This is the kind of action you'll see when KW comes to your town. And KW is coming, invading New Albany, Mississippi. That's Saturday, April 24th. New Albany, Mississippi. Get your tickets. It's going to be at the Silver Dome Arena. Tickets available at color time as Brickhouse with a belly-to-back suplex on Rogers. All you people in New Albany, get your chairs ready. Get your boards ready. Count of two and only a count of two. KW delivers the wildest action Russian leg sweep. The wildest action in the Mid-South. The most hardcore, and you can see it live and in person. It's always a lot better when you're right close to the wrestlers and can hand them their weapons. Diving headbutt out of Brickhouse. Tommy Rogers set up out of that. A very evenly contested fight. Rogers into the rope. Elbow into the top of the head on Brickhouse Brown. Both of these guys veterans in the wrestling profession. What they're looking for is the other guy to make a mistake. Whip into the rope. Power slam. Center of the ring. Rogers down for the cover. Rush down. Count of two. No. Only a count of two. Coming up, after this matchup, we're going to take a look at that video with one man gang that 400. He's over 400 pounds. He's a monster. He has sent in a video challenge. We're going to be taking a look at that after this matchup is over. Brickhouse coming alive with a series of fists. Irish whip into the ropes. Roger in hard. And now Rogers reverses it, goes in. We saw him do this earlier in the show. Drives Brickhouse's head into the mat. That could be it. Look out. It's Izzy. It's Izzy in for a little revenge from that match earlier in the night. Todd Morton. Todd Morton is in the ring now. Look out, it's the fabulous rocker, the former light heavyweight champion. This ring is filling up with all the light heavyweights, and here comes the current champion, Danny B. He's looking up. All of the lightweights.
was fighting out in the ring, Danny B came out with a message. I couldn't hear what he said. Izzy with a super kick on the rocker. Brickhouse said, to hell with all this. You lightweights can battle it out. We got to take a timeout. We got to go to break. When we come back, we're going to be hearing from the one, one, man, man, gang, gang. gang.